Welcome to Hydrohaven. Today we're revealing the single most powerful amendment that solves virtually every common soil problem, properly brewed, living compost tea. This isn't about chasing trendy products or juggling complicated routines, it's about the one proven solution that professional growers have trusted for generations. Let's get straight into it. Living compost tea is more than just plant food, it's a complete ecosystem reset for your soil. Where fertilizers merely patch nutrient deficiencies, compost tea works at the root of the problem by rebuilding the soil's microbial foundation. From compacted clay and nutrient-depleted sand to poor drainage, chemical toxicity and persistent disease pressure, compost tea has the power to correct them all. The secret lies in the living microbial communities it introduces, bacteria, fungi, protozoa and more, that perform critical interdependent roles in soil health. Healthy soil is alive. It teems with billions of microorganisms that form intricate webs of life, breaking down organic matter, cycling nutrients, creating structure, suppressing disease, and producing growth-stimulating compounds. Modern practices, tilling, synthetic fertilizers, fungicides have devastated these essential communities. Compost tea restores them, allowing your soil to function as nature intended. Studies show that properly brewed tea can increase beneficial microbe populations by over 10,000 times in just 24 hours. These microbes physically transform your soil. Bacteria excrete sticky glues that bind particles into aggregates, improving water retention and aeration. Fungi weave through the soil, forming networks that hold structure, enhance nutrient flow, and suppress pathogens. No physical amendment, sand, perlite, or vermiculite can create this kind of biological architecture. Start with four essentials. High-quality compost, a food source for microbes, consistent aeration, and clean, dechlorinated water. Use a five-gallon bucket filled with water that sat uncovered for 24 hours to remove chlorine. Keep the water temperature between 65 degrees and 85 degrees Fahrenheit. For aeration, a basic aquarium pump with multiple air stones works well. Place two to three cups of rich, earthy-smelling compost into a mesh bag and suspend it in the water. Add two tablespoons of unsulfured blackstrap molasses to feed bacteria. For a fungal-leaning brew, ideal for perennials and trees, also add one tablespoon of humic acid and a handful of rolled oats. Let the mixture brew with constant aeration for 24 to 36 hours. You'll know it's ready when it has a light brown color, an earthy aroma, and a light foam on top, signs of thriving microbial activity. Use the tea within 4 hours of stopping aeration. For soil application, dilute it 1 to 3 with dechlorinated water. For foliar spraying, use a 1 to 5 dilution. Apply during early morning or late afternoon to protect microbes from UV damage. In distressed gardens, apply weekly for the first month. For ongoing maintenance, apply monthly. Each gallon of diluted tea covers about 50 square feet. Apply directly to the root zone using a watering can without a rose attachment to avoid clogs. Improvements begin immediately, stronger growth, richer foliage. But the most profound changes come with time. Clay soils gradually loosen and become more workable. Sandy soils retain more moisture and nutrients. Microbes don't just help plants, they build lasting soil structure and fertility. If your soil is heavy clay, focus on fungal dominant brews. Extend the brewing time to 36 hours and include extra fungal foods like humic acid and oatmeal. For sandy, fast-draining soils aim for bacterial dominance. Brew for 24 hours and add more molasses to encourage bacterial growth. If disease is a recurring issue, use nettle or comfrey-enriched compost to produce suppressive teas. Nettle-based tea, for example, has been shown to reduce powdery mildew by up to 80%. For soils contaminated by past chemical use, add a tablespoon of powdered activated charcoal. This boosts detoxifying microbes that help break down harmful residues. With regular use, most gardeners see reduced watering needs, stronger plants, and fewer disease issues within a single season. Nutrient cycling becomes synchronized with plant needs thanks to the work of the microbial community. After two to three years of consistent application, Many gardens become nearly self-sustaining, with little to no need for fertilizers or other inputs. 
Compost tea doesn't just fix your soil, it sets it on a path toward permanent health and resilience. Subscribe to Hydrohaven to catch our upcoming series on advanced compost tea recipes for specific plant groups. And if you know a fellow gardener battling tired, lifeless soil, share this video. They just might thank you for years to come. Happy gardening and here's to living soil!